Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, and we have some breaking news. Video footage has been released of Donald Trump pleading the Fifth Amendment over 400 times during his deposition for the New York Attorney General. Now this deposition, which I'm going to show you in a moment, is in connection to the New York Attorney General's investigation into Donald Trump, his adult children, and others involved with the Trump Organization. And basically, the New York Attorney General is alleging that Donald Trump and the other defendants artificially raised Donald Trump's net worth and the values of his properties in order to receive better terms from insurers and banks, which of course is a crime. In the fall, the New York Attorney General filed a $250 million lawsuit against Donald Trump Trump, his adult children, and the other defendants based on these allegations that they have extensive proof of. So that's the context for the deposition I'm going to show you. And it truly is a crazy video. So Donald Trump started the deposition by saying that he will plead the fifth to all of the answers. Take a look at his opening statement. Anyone in my position not taking the Fifth Amendment would be a fool, an absolute fool. One statement or answer that is ever so slightly off, just ever so slightly, by accident, by mistake, such as it was a sunny, beautiful day when actually it was slightly overcast, would be met by law enforcement under the advice of my counsel. And for all of the above reasons, I respectfully decline to answer the questions under the rights and privileges afforded to every citizen under the United States Constitution. So yeah, he's saying that based on the advice that his lawyers gave him, he will not be answering any questions other than what is your name. And that's really funny because during the 2016 election, Donald Trump said that innocent people don't plead the Fifth Amendment. Take a look at that video. So there are five people taking the Fifth Amendment, like you see on the mob, right? You see the mob takes the Fifth Amendment. If you're innocent, why are you taking the Fifth Amendment? Now that's incredibly hypocritical, isn't it? But of course, we've also received video footage of Donald Trump actually pleading the Fifth to every question, and he just says same answer to every time, implying that he's taking the Fifth. Take a look at that video. 2019 statement of financial condition contained false and misleading valuations and statements. Is that correct? Same answer. You knew at the time it was finalized that the year 2019 statement of financial condition contained false and misleading statements, is that correct? Same answer. In preparing the 2019 statement of financial condition, uh, Mr. Weisselberg and Mr. McConney worked at your direction and followed your instructions to inflate asset valuations on the statement of financial condition by employing false and misleading assumptions, is that correct? Same answer. Now, here's the really important thing to understand about this case. In criminal cases, when someone pleads the fifth, that means that that answer cannot be used against them in a court of law. But this case is not criminal. It's a civil case. So Donald Trump pleading the fifth over 400 times can absolutely be used against him. Basically, that's called an adverse inference against Donald Trump. And basically what that means is that the judge and the jury can assume that the reason that Donald Trump didn't answer those questions is to cover up wrongdoing. So in short, him pleading pleading the fifth over 400 times can absolutely be used against him in this case, and it most likely will be. But to be honest, my immediate reaction to these videos is that it's pathetic. Like this is a former president of the United States having to plead the fifth over 400 times. I mean, of course that right is there for a reason, but in my view, no president should have to plead the fifth ever. And in the video, he just appears to be angry and defeated, and it's certainly not a very good look. But hey, Donald Trump said it himself, innocent people don't take the fifth. So Donald, if you're innocent, why are you pleading the fifth over 400 times? What I also think is funny here is that you know who has never had to plead the fifth amendment? Joe Biden, Hillary Clinton, Barack Obama, Nancy Pelosi, and other Democrats. But I think we can all see by now that Donald Trump and his family are just a bunch of criminals. So I guess it's not all that surprising that Donald Trump and members of his family have pled the fifth an absurd amount of times. But I can assure you that this case is not good for Donald Trump. The evidence is really, really strong against him. And if if they find criminal wrongdoing that can be referred to another investigation and they could prosecute him criminally. And I can assure you that Donald Trump would not be pleading the fifth that many times if he didn't think that they had strong evidence on him. But regardless, for the 2024 presidential election, I think that Democrats should just play that clip over and over again and then immediately follow it up with Donald Trump saying, no innocent people take the fifth. But yeah, overall, just not a good look. And that's gonna wrap up the video for today, folks. I really hope you enjoyed watching. I would really appreciate if you could leave a like, a comment, and of course, subscribe. All of your guys' support has been so amazing and I can't thank you enough. And once again, whether you agree with me or you disagree with me, have a great rest of your day and I hope to see you folks soon.